Shalom Israel. All praises to the Most High God. First and foremost, I would like to thank every last person that's participating in this fast. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much. Thank you for having courage. Thank you for your character. Thank you for your complete lack of selfishness. I thank you. Today, we are going to be fasting for our people, the Israelites, every so-called black, Hispanic and Native American that has been scattered to the four corners of this planet. What we're going to be doing today is taking a part in a fast starting from 12 p.m. Central Standard Time until 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. For those of you on the East Coast, that means from 1 p.m. to 7 p.m. And the rest of you can do your own calculations. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to lead us in prayer. Now, you can do your own individual prayers afterwards. But today, I would like for us to please stand on the prayer that I'm going to cry out to the Most High for. And please endure in your fast. Take it all the way to the end. Don't give up. Six hours. Six hours. That's all it's going to be. Six hours. Now, remember, as we just recently learned, when we pray, we have to be facing the east. So we're going to face the east. And if you are able, please hit your knees or put yourself in a humble position. Sit down. Arms raised, heads bowed to the ground to show your humbleness to the Most High, just like our forefathers and our foremothers used to do. All right. So at this moment, right now, we are getting ready to pray out to the Father. All right. And here we go, family. Father, we come to you through the honorable name of your son, Jesus Christ. Yeshua, Yahweh Shai whichever way that you choose to identify the son of the most high God. Father, we come to you collectively to pray for the Israelites, every so-called black, Hispanic and Native American that is that has been scattered on this planet. Father, the first thing that we want to do, we want to pray that you please make us humble. Father, we pray for wisdom. Father, we pray for your guidance Father, we pray for your protection against our enemies. Father, we would like to pray for every last person that has been suffering from an affliction, something within their body. If it is within your will, Father, we please ask that you heal them from the crown of their head to the sole of their feet. Father, we ask that you stop the pain. Father, we pray for every person that is battling drug addiction, alcoholism, we pray for any person that is suffering from a dependency and not coming to you. Father, we pray that you give us a strength to seek you. We pray for the encouragement from even within our brothers and sisters to come to us so that they can hear and understand your word. Father, we pray for the strength to keep your laws, your statutes and your commandments. Father, we pray for peace within our brotherhood and our sisterhood, Father. We pray for the peace amongst our brethren. Father, we pray that the fighting stop amongst the camps. Father, you said in your word, gather yourselves together, O nation not desired. And we are asking you to please bring that into fruition, Father. We are asking for the strength. We're asking that you please shed the hate out of our hearts for each other. So that we can look at each other as we are as kings, queens, princes, and princesses. That we recognize each other. And instead of pulling a gun on each other or any acts of violence, we can embrace each other with hugs. Father, we ask that you please stop us from insulting each other. From the harmful banter. And put love and words of encouragement into our hearts to bring out to our brothers and sisters. Father, we pray for the marriages within Israel. Father, we pray that you give our kings the strength to lead and our sisters the strength to be submissive to their husbands so that they can create a family unit that follows you and carries out your will so that the children can come up 
under the law's statutes and commandments and carry out your will as well and continue that throughout our generations. Father, we ask that you please break every spirit that's on our brothers and sisters that will not adopt your dress code, which is indeed a sin. Father, we ask these things in the great name of your son, Jesus, Yeshua, Yahweh Shai, whichever way that you choose to identify him. Father, we ask and we cry out right now to you to please hear our prayers and please acknowledge our fast. Father, we do this in the great name of your son, Jesus, we pray. Amen. There it is, family. Prayers up. Now it's time for you to do your part. Now you have to partake in the fast. Do not give up. Encourage each other. If you guys have each other's numbers or emails or Instagrams, Facebooks, it doesn't matter what you have. Reach out to them and encourage them. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Endure. You see, this is all about endurance. This is all about to see if you are able to last. And let me tell you something right now. I am proud of each and every last one of you. I know it doesn't mean much coming from me, but let me tell you something right now. I am proud. I am proud to be your brother. I am proud to be your spiritual leader. I am proud to be an Israelite. I am proud to be a son of the most high God. And most importantly, I am proud to be a part of this family that is led by the most high God and his son. And let me tell you, family, we have not that much longer left. No man knows the day or the hour, but everything that is going on in the world right now, time is drawing near. Look up for our redemption draws nigh. That time is coming and we need to participate in these fasts more and more and more. Now, if any of you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me on Instagram. That is the fastest way that you can get me. And I will try my best to answer everybody in an expeditious fashion. But once again, family, I am so proud of y'all and I love you. And again, I want to thank you so, so, so much for participating in this fast. And once again, family, give all the honor and praise and glory and adoration to the God of Israel, our father in heaven, the most high God. And with that being said, Israel. I love y'all and I'm out.